class, this is Mom Says, signing on. This PP lecture will talk about encapsulation in Java with sample program. Let's begin. On your screen is the meaning of encapsulation. It says encapsulation in Java is a mechanism of wrapping the data, the so-called variables, and code acting on the data or the so-called methods. So together, it is as a single unit. So in, in encapsulation, the variables of a class will be hidden from other classes and can be accessed only through the methods of their current class, meaning to make the fields in a class private and to provide access to the fields through public methods, we use the technique called encapsulation. The field that is declared as a private cannot be accessed by anyone outside the class. It hides the fields within the class. For this reason, encapsulation is also uh, referred to as a data hiding. Encapsulation acts as a protective barrier that uh, prevents the code and data being randomly accessed by other code defined outside the class. It has the ability to modify our implemented code without breaking the code of others who use our code. It can make the code maintainable, easy to troubleshoot, and then flexible. We can reuse it with other class without affecting other class or other variables or, or other data or methods. And it is also extensible. So we could expand it anything we like, whatever methods we would like to add in our classes. So there's no need for more coding, many more coding or long source code or program. In our sample program here, we have the personal information such as we have the name, the age, ID number here in our main class. Notice in the method below, our main class starts at line 17 here. There is an instantiation of the main class and using the keyword in cup and the private keyword here, we encapsulated the data to protect the personal inf information. So, this is where the encapsulation comes in, or data hiding, or the so called protecting the data. Let's talk about get and set. As mentioned earlier, private variables can only be accessed within the same class. An outside class has no access to it, obviously. However, it is possible to access them if we provide public get and set, just like what you see on your screen. This uh, get method returns the variable, the returns the variable value, and uh, and the set method here, it sets the value, obviously. So. Whatever the value of our name here, for example, goes to the new variable name, which is new name here. So this is the parameter. It's because of the set keyword here. Notice the syntax for both get and set. Is that they start with either get here or set then followed by the name of the variable the name so in this example it's the name notice the first letter in uppercase just like what you see in your screen so we have get name then letter n is capitalized here and then we have set name then the letter n is capitalized here So why encapsulate? 
you see on your skin here are some advantages of encapsulation so better control of class attributes and methods we could just uh, call it from one class to another class and then class attributes can be made read only so data protection that is when we use the get method that makes our class read only or we can also make our class write only if uh, this when you use the set method so it's a write only so you can replace the value of the variable into something by using the set method just like what is shown in our previous sample program and also encapsulation makes our program or class flexible meaning the programmer can change one part of the code without affecting other parts so no need to run all throughout the programs rewrite all the programs with a very long source code and another advantages of encapsulation is it increased security of data so it protects confidential information or personal information something like that and that ends our discussion hope these codes inspires you as you develop your programming skills and so that's it watch out for more video lectures stay safe and god bless everyone thank you for watching this is mom says signing off